If you thought Red Bull was strong this season, wait until you see them next year. Hmm, sounds familiar. Reports from Italy claim that the Red Bull will be developing their existing ideas to an extreme level. That doesn't bode well for the competition who are finally getting a little bit closer. Let's have a look at what's true about Red Bull having a radically different concept. I'm Wimbo, here's 3 seconds to leave a like. Red Bull want to keep dominating next season in F1, as a recent report reveals the Austrian team is on a path to having the perfect car in 2024. As per the Italian publication Gazzetta dello Sport, the RB20 will be a radically different concept than the all-conquering RB19, making the Red Bull's advantage over the field even further than it has been this year. Technical analyst Paolo Fisiletti said the following about the RB20. It appears that the vertical load will be generated and distributed in a radically different way than now. The floor will function differently, adopting a very different volumetric conformation of the Venturi channels. I'm not a technical YouTuber and I doubt I'll ever be one, but this quote sounds like a huge change in an already mighty effective package. Do we need to prepare for another year without a proper title fight? Red Bull's chief engineer Paul Monaghan has come out with a few details of the much feared RB20 just before the race weekend in Las Vegas. He didn't go as far as describing their plans as radical or extreme. He did point out that the competition is getting closer, so something needs to be done. He said, it would be wrong for us to just leave it alone because our opposition is getting a bit closer. But the rules are quite tight compared to what we've had in previous years and with previous generations of cars where we could do a little bit more and move things around. It perhaps wouldn't surprise you if I said it will be an evolution of the current car, as it will be a bit foolish to throw this concept away. But equally, we've got to make some progress. We've got to find some lap time. The opposition is on us, and if they do a step, then we'd better make a bigger step. So it looks like our Italian friends are going a little bit over the top again with their claims. Mamma mia! Would you please be so kind as to subscribe? I need less than 90 subscribers to make it into the YouTube program. With your help, we'll get there. I make two to three videos per week and a podcast monthly. Thanks a million. I'm pretty hopeful that 2024 will be a banger of a season. What this season already proved is that in the current regulations, you can't write anyone off as teams fluctuate in their performance over the long season. The rise of McLaren is a great example of that. The same goes for Aston Martin. Ferrari and Mercedes are always expected to do well, although I think they will be facing a tough season. It's funny, but the season isn't over yet, and I'm already looking forward to seeing the new cars testing. <laughs> I'm such a weirdo. What about you guys? Are you looking forward to a new season? Leave a comment. Take care now. Doei doei.